We ended up working in third grade with um, writing and social studies. And so we ended up doing a, a production with that. So they did some playwriting and produced a play. I met with third grade teachers and we were looking at weaknesses. We identified their weakness to be writing and we wanted our students to be able to write just a little bit better, but also to be engaged while writing. they worked it into what they had planned. So we, we chose the Native American, uh, social studies Native American standards that they had to do. And then we also had our writing standards. And so taking a look, especially with the artists, the artists helped us to coordinate, you know, these two sets of standards with then the other aspects of the art to come up with the play. So we came together with the main goal of how we wanted them to be assessed and how we wanted them to do in the performance and we just kind of took everything we had already done and kind of implemented the theater and the writing that way. We were able to um, show how learning can be connected and how it's a beneficial to students to go on a deeper level with their knowledge by connecting these pieces together. We used a story called Prudy's Problem. So the students were able to create a backstory about Prudy, and they were constantly writing. They used the, um, the writing as a way to create the screenplay to create the plays that they did. So they had to create the sets, they had to create the designs, they had to create the costumes for all of that. seeing the bright smiles in the hallway, excited, and teachers who want to come to school the last month of school who are excited about somebody to come in to collaborate with them and work with them. Seeing them go from not wanting to write to wanting to write was unbelievable. Students whose behavior might uh, limit them from being part of a group, um, this was certainly an incentive to make sure that your behavior was back in, in check so that you could do the activities with everyone. So we saw some real changes there. The other change that we saw was how well the kids worked together with each other and how they really grew as a group with listening to each other, problem solving with each other, honoring each other's ideas so that then they could put this all together. Those kinds of things are lifelong lessons that all of us need to know. I would tell them that it's right for every student. Bringing it to any school, it's so beneficial. They're constantly wanting to come to school. They want to learn, and I think that if any teacher has the opportunity to do it, they definitely need to.